I'm heading to Baker Allegan Fiber Studios in Old Mill Yarn in Allegan, Michigan for Mother's Day. And I can't wait to show you guys what they have inside. Let's go. So this is the historic building for Baker Allegan Studios and it's the Old Mill Yarn. Look at this big spinning wheel that is so cool. So let's go in and check it out. Look at these beautiful handmade dolls. They have a huge selection of woven items and look at these big looms that they have. Look at these beautiful scarves that they made with all these beautiful patterns. Now just don't go anywhere because they do sell mill ends of yarn, so we will be taking a look at that. But look at these gorgeous pieces. The patterns are so intricate and beautiful. The owners are so nice too. I really enjoy talking with them and they actually live upstairs in that building where the mill is located. And here we have some hand-woven toddler and baby blankets. And then we have some beautiful wraps. Look at that. And some scarves. And then we have some stools to sit in front of the spinning loom. Some more linens, table runners, and towels. Now this side of the shop has some yarn and some other weaving tools. Let's go check it out. And then if you look over here, here's some of their hand dyed yarn selection. They didn't seem to have a lot of hand dyed yarn, but the yarn that they did have was very pretty. They had a lot of cones out on the main floor that you could purchase for the mill ends. A lot of these are wool. Absolutely beautiful. Here's some more hand dyed yarn. Make sure you stick around to the end to see what I purchased today at the shop. Here we have bags of fleece that needs to be spun, more cones, and then we have some roving they could be spun. All different colors. And then we have some more looms and accessories, some shuttles. And here we have another beautiful loom. Now here are some beautiful hand-woven rugs. Aren't these gorgeous? Love that. So pretty. They even have a rug painted on the floor. This is the room with most of the mill ends. Now they do have a uh, revolving stock, so you will never find the same thing twice usually because they buy out other companies and then they sell their mill ends. And today they seem to have a lot of thread and a lot of chenille. And here you can see you can get 12 different ones for $24.50. That's a great deal. And then it looks like here is some chenille. There's a lot of different chenille. And they're beautiful colors. And there's a pretty little scarf that they made using it. Love that. 
So it just depends on what you're looking for and when you go because there's always a revolving stock like I said. And look at these short tubes, $3 a pound. That's a killer deal. This would be great for somebody who makes a lot of earrings and wanted a lot of different colors because of all the different threads they have. These large skeins on the bottom are actually rug yarn and they have silk running through them. That's what the owner told me. Check out these adorable little knitted dolls. So cute. There's some more. And then the outside is just beautiful. There's water all around the old mill. And they do live upstairs, which is really neat. Wonder what it looks like in there. I'd be afraid to be haunted. I mean, just saying. <laughs> but isn't that beautiful? Very cool. And if you are ever in Allegan, Michigan, I suggest stopping by because you never know what kind of yarn you're going to find. Now let's take a look at all the goodies that I bought while I was there. So let me show you what I got while we were on this trip. My husband bought me this yarn that I picked out. Isn't it pretty? This is, has a very 70s vibe. It's like a boucle yarn. So I'm going to make a granny square pillow cover out of this beautiful yarn. And um, we'll see how big it gets. The tag does not say how many yards are on it. So we will find out how it looks when it's finished. And I think I'll probably use a nice bright yellow for the backing and then just use this for the whole front of the granny square pillow. So I love this. And then I also got this pretty little mug rug. This is, um, you know, one of their little woven items that they had up by the cash register. It was only $4.50. And this did not have a price tag on it. So I ended up getting it for five bucks. I lucked out. I mean, this is so pretty. I love it. Hand dyed. And then you guys might remember this. I had to get one of these. I had one exactly like this when I was a kid, one of those little pot holder looms. And this is a little metal one, exactly the same color and everything as the one that I had as a kid. And it comes with these little uh, loops. And then it comes with this little thing here. And then here is the loom right here. I mean, same exact one that I had as a child. And then I also got this bag, another bag of loops right here. And this, I swear, this is the same packaging that they had back in the 70s when I had this as a kid. So this place was really fun to check out. And if you are ever in the Allegan, Michigan area, here's their business card. And I hope you go by and check them out. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. I hope to see you soon. And if you want to see more Yarny Field Trips, make sure you check out the playlist I have linked below. Have a great day, everyone. Bye.